plays white text and a black background. Triathlon, swim to bike transition. Coach Beth goes running into the screen. Hey, hey, it's Coach Beth. Hopefully you just got done watching the video on open swim with Coach Olivia and Coach Doc. I just ran in from the open swim and now I am going to be in the transition to get ready to do some biking for our triathlon. So what I have here is my towel laying out, ready for me to sit on. I have water, I have some sunglasses and a hat. I also have some sunscreen. I have another small towel to go ahead and dry off my legs and my feet. I have my bike shoes and my bike helmet and my bike stationed and ready. So I'm gonna go ahead and get on my towel, go ahead and dry off my feet and my legs for my open swim pool. And remember, the transition time in a triathlon continues your clock. So it's, it's important to do transition quickly. This counts as time within your race. Some people wear socks when they bike. Some don't, some just put their bike shoes right on and get ready to ride their bike. I'm gonna go ahead and wear socks today. Got my socks on. Now I'm putting my bike shoes on. Now it's important to note that it's very, very important in triathlons that you put your helmet on and buckle it before you touch your bicycle or get your bike going. Or you may be what's called DQ, which is disqualified or you might get points against you for not following those race regulations. So both my sneakers are on, my helmet is on, I have quick water. Always have to stay hydrated when in a triathlon race. A little bit of sunscreen spray, make sure that I stay nice and protected from the sun. I have my hat if I want to wear it. I'm going to choose to just put my sunglasses on and then I'm ready. And now since I have my helmet on, I'm going to go ahead and get ready to transition into the bike portion of the triathlon. Now, another important tip is once you grab your bike, you cannot just jump on it and start riding. There's a dismount location where you have to be off your bike when you come back from your bike rate and also a mounting location. So once you grab your bike or your tandem bike, you need to go ahead and walk it past the line for mounting. And then you're able to get on your bike and start the rest of your triathlon race. So come on, let's go racing with me. Time to bike, woo woo. Coach Beth runs off with her bike.